did I say and you do? Well, I got uh, first uh, acquainted with a partnership uh, several years ago, more than several years ago, when um, uh, we were at a dinner party with uh, Dr. Bob Ritchie, and he and several others mentioned uh, the um, adopt a school program and uh, I thought it sounded very good and we agreed to do it uh, that evening. And we've had a lot of uh, kids from the Parker School over here and it's, it's fun at that age to see a bank and to see a pile of money and to get some uh, flavor of what a local business is all about. I think the partnership efforts in the school system have been very rewarding for those schools that have taken part. I think it's a good opportunity for the business community and the schools to work together to improve the total educational picture for the students. Involvement with partnerships on the part of our Bella Mutual Insurance Company is limited really to the Sterling School involvement. But it seems to make a lot of sense to me. The first, obviously, is that we have established ourselves as an advocate of public education. We have established our company's image as being active and involved in the local community. But there's also a benefit in terms of our own training and development. The best companies in the world spend a lot of money and time on training and developing their own people. And clearly, there's been a, a spin-off effect, a positive effect on our own programs. And here you have a middle school, an exciting middle school, that has accepted a five-year program to reform and restructure middle school curriculum and the way it's delivered with an accelerated schools project out of Stanford University. And we've been matched and coupled with the third largest insurance carrier in the state of Massachusetts, a dynamic and growing company. What is great is that we both share a common vision for and a commitment to excellence. My view of our partnership efforts in the business world uh, is, uh, is, is very general and very positive. There are many different types of partnerships, as uh, you all know, and there have been no limitations. It's been a very positive relationship with the Montclair School, with its principal, Ms. Zukowskis. Uh, it, it's been just an incredibly positive relationship. We have been able to conduct uh, outside of the actual classroom uh, uh, programs. We've been able to produce uh, visits to the bank uh, for the children so they can see the bank in action uh, behind the scenes. That's all the vision is, is multiplication in which they give you an answer and leave out one factor. There's an officer assigned to each grade level. They explain what in fact they do at the bank, what their background is. So it's a commitment. The teachers learn, the kids do, and I think the people at the bank do. So I mean it, it is fantastic and it's made an impact on their learning. And plus, when they ride by Quincy Savings Bank, they say, that's my bank. I can't say enough good about the people we work with, Lou Martinez, Don Houghton, uh, Mary Catherine Iannone, uh, the whole Quincy uh, Central Middle School group as a whole. We hire people on a very frequent basis. If those people aren't qualified, not only uh, able to read, to write, to understand, but don't have that, that background in technology, the business world itself will suffer. It's something that all business should be involved with. All business. With, with the attitude that both the school has and the, the company, Mass Electric, I think that we can go as far as we, our dreams take us. So, uh, as I said originally, it's limitless. I think that the uh, business community understands the fact that it has a responsibility to help society uh, develop with fairness and efficiency for all. Together we are really beginning to see the tangible results of tackling the many issues that we face uh, in terms of making sure we produce a well-educated uh, student uh, population who will ultimately become the uh, workers, uh, managers, and business leaders of the future. What's the purpose of having a convenience store that nobody can get to or that's not convenient to get to? I think that the students of the Quincy Public School Systems now are more than ever receptive for our mission statement, certainly speaking for the high schools, which is re learning responsibility and adulthood. It causes the business community and the community in general to become a partner in a positive vein with the educational sector. And I think it also speaks to the cultural diversity in the city. So I think that the, uh, the partnership effect on the system is extremely positive. So I think it is a remarkable effort and has considerable promise for the future. Opportunity. This is something we both promise and deliver on. 
knowledge, which is the industry that we are in, and achievement, which this program is especially focused on. Any ways that Quincy College can bring these values and services to bear, I feel will be a plus to the effort. Our teachers and our students have had a, a sense that there are people out there in the community that are very interested in what they're doing. That's a great morale booster, just to know that there are people out there in the community that are really concerned about what it is that you're trying to do. Obviously, uh, the partnerships give us a sense of career opportunities for the children. It's infectious, the enthusiasm of the kids. This, the sense that you get that I'm doing something worthwhile, the sense that I'm making a, a, a contribution, that I can sit, sit down beside a child and help that child. I just think that's tremendous motivation. I know when, when I, as a superintendent, have an opportunity uh, to visit a school, um, it, it brings me back to, to that wonderful feelings that I had as a principal and a classroom teacher. That day-by-day -day contact with kids where you know you're really making a difference. So everybody wants to get the maximum for their investment in time particularly and I think once you uh, get face to face with what is happening and how it's happening uh, it's a very easy sell. It's been very cooperative. Uh, I found the South Shore National Bank people to be extremely interested in what goes on at Parker, have been very willing to share the resources that they have at their bank in terms of uh, their facility, in terms of their staff. I believe that long term we will have a relationship with Sterling School one way or the other. We are neighbors to begin with. It's a good thing to be involved in because they've got to remember that business requires a skilled workforce and business cannot do the job of training our young people. That is the job of the schools. And there is a direct benefit in being involved in something like this. It's a win-win partnership, both for the students and Sterling community and for the employees of our Bella. They've been able to share with us their managerial expertise, which is going to go a long way as we enter the problem-solving phase of our accelerated schools reform. You want to feel good and you want to do something real special and important in this community and get involved with a business school partnership in some fashion, whatever fashion is most suitable and responsible for your own business. I've decided we couldn't take another bank as a partnership because there's a sense of loyalty. We've, we've built a sense of trust and I always see that even if the formalized partnership will be over, there'll definitely be a friendship between the Montclair School and the Quincy Savings Bank. I can't say enough good about it. Uh, it's been excellent, excellent, wonderful people, wonderful people. We have to have everyone involved in the city of Quincy, both industry and schools involved with one another, sharing successes. Uh, I would love to share Mass Electric with other people. If they want to find themselves in a situation where they will uh, be helpful to young people who are very creative. The program has been tremendous. I mean, when you really look at the excitement that has been created, I would hope that the system-wide partnership uh, would expand and that all the students in the Quincy Public Schools Many of the parents, certainly all of the teachers and faculty, would take advantage of such partnerships and uh, make a very, very uh, informative situation and a knowledgeable one for all the people in Quincy. Come now, because this is an exciting program that's already moving. It's going to pick up speed. Get on board while you can. We are certainly a model and uh, can hold ourselves up as a model for other communities. The program is working great. Uh, I am extremely excited about uh, our partnership program. And I know that uh, with the spirit and enthusiasm that we have, uh, the principals, the teachers, the classroom uh, people, the business community, the agencies, that uh, we are going to really take off uh, in the next few years. How many people knew what I was saying about the vision and multiplication of their cousins?